Hi guys, so this is my entry to the Hacker Day competition. It is an audio cube, uh, not an audio die, the singular of dice, I didn't like that name, so we've gone for an audio cube. Uh, the idea is that it's uh, a tool for people with uh, sight disabilities so that they can hear the number that they've rolled. Uh, it uses an ADXL345 chip, which is a, an accelerometer, and it uses an AT Mega328 and it also uses uh, an SD card to play the audio from. Uh, I'm using open source software, so it's all, all the libraries that I'm using are open source. I'm just doing the logic portion, not really writing libraries for myself, not really my bag. So here it is in action. It's progressed a little bit from here onto an SMD based cube, so it's a lot smaller um, and it'll have maybe an acrylic outside or something uh, and it's mostly SMD, not all SMD and it's uh, using these standoffs. So this isn't a perfect cube but the case that goes around it will be hopefully. It doesn't meet some of the criteria. Originally the criteria said that it just had to be connected in some way and that was fine uh, I was going to say, I was going to shoehorn in, it makes a noise and communicates to you what, uh, what side it's rolled onto. But now the requirements state that it must connect to another device. Now I could um, add a little wireless thing in here, perhaps Bluetooth, and have another cube so that they add the numbers together, so two, two dice. So it really could be called audio dice then I guess. But I've not got to that point yet. All I'm at now is this stage. So. And I've got to learn how to solder SMD stuff. It's going to be difficult. Anyway, thank you very much for watching.